Hi, my name is Justin with Justin Paul Management, and I'm going to talk with you today about understanding cash flow statements. Cash flow statements are one of three of the primary financial statements that business people use to understand the state and healthiness, if you will, of a business. Uh, the other two uh, financial statements are the balance sheet and the income statement. Uh, but today I'm going to talk with you about the cash flow statement. What the cash flow statement does is it shows how money flows through a company. And uh, this is done in three primary sec sections, as I'll show you here in a second. And for this example, I'm going to use a uh, fictitious company called Larry's Lemonade to show you how the company actually uses the cash flow statement to state its position. And uh, what the people that use the cash flow statements are, uh, for example, of course, the management to understand whether or not they are going to be able to pay bills coming up. Uh, investors would like to see a cash flow statement to understand whether or not the company is making money and how the company is making money. Another institution that might like to know is banks who may be lending the, uh, the company money. And uh, what they're going to want to see is whether or not, through a cash flow statement, the company is going to be able to pay any kind of interest notes in the upcoming period. So those are the people that like to see a cash flow statement and the reasons they want to see it. So let's look at Larry's company and see how it's performing based on its cash flow statement. All right, so here we are looking at the cash flow statement for Larry's Lemonade. And cash flow statements are always period based. So uh, while we don't have a period on here, we're going to assume this may be an annual. Uh, it could also be quarterly or even monthly, depending on what kind of statement you're looking at. And uh, what a cash flow statement does is shows you how the cash flows or moves in and out of a company. Uh, it takes money to make money, as we know. And so cash flow statements help you understand what a company is spending money on and how and where it is making money. So let's look here at, at this example. Um, cash flow statements are always divided into three sections, an operating activities, investing activities, and financing activities. Operating activities cover all of your normal business operations. For example, whatever it is a company sells, in this case lemonade, we see there the sale of lemonade is $1,000. That's how this company makes most of its money. And normal operations would, would require paying employees, would be to purchase uh, lemons and sugar and cups, and of course other items like interest payments. Investing activities cover things like um, actual uh, purchasing of an asset. For example, we have here, we have a lemonade stand was purchased. It cost $100. You see that there in parentheses, meaning a negative number. Uh, they also purchased a blender to probably blend the lemons and mix all the sugar and everything else. So we have a negative $250 in the investing activities. The last section is financing activities. And this covers uh, things like business loans. It could be the selling of stock. If, it were, if you were to sell stock, you would see a positive number here. If you were to repurchase that stock, you would uh, see um, a negative number. And that can be a good thing as far as investors are concerned. You see a company buying its stock back. And there we have net cash at the bottom of $390. Now, the company may have reported $390 as the net profits for this period. It's important then to understand that there was a, a small business loan of $250 that gave this company extra money. So that's how you read a cash flow statement. This is a simple example, but it should get you through any other uh, cash flow statements that are much more complicated and give you an idea of what those different sections mean and how they could be applied to understand how a company uses cash to make money and where it spends money.